girl, you're blessed with a gift to the track. You know you got my front and my back. Good morning. I don't know if I've said this, but this holiday isn't really a, a park's holiday all there, although we are going to the parks. Um, it's just a nice relaxing holiday for us, we're going to do some different things. We're going to Halloween Horror Nights for a couple of nights, and we're going to Mickey's Not So Scary, and that's what we've got planned. I know people like to see and get information about the park, so while we're there we'll definitely do that, but as I say, we're trying to do some other things. So today we're going to Disney Springs to see the upgraded park of it, I've not seen yet. Um, and we'll catch up with you when we get there. Well, this is us in Disney Springs, parked the car. And now we're going to head for the elevators. Just need to watch that there's no cars coming. So we've came quite early in the morning and the parking garages or whatever they call them are really empty. We're on the ground floor, never been on the ground floor ever before. But um, we are. This is a lime garage, again we normally go orange garage. Because we're normally coming from the other side, from the villa side. Um, so we came from International Drive along I-4 and then you cut off at Lake Buena Vista. It was only about a five, was that, ten minutes? It's uh, starting to bounce, it's getting quite much bigger than I thought it would be. It's a Friday right enough. This place will be jumping the night. Friday night's always a busy night. Morning. So I think this this takes you into the kind of older section. I think uh, Disney Springs, or it used to be called Downtown Disney. Jackie's behind me again. Say good morning. Good morning. Good morning. That's a nice food, isn't it? So that's somewhere that people have been recommending us to eat. It's a light pig. I think it's a kind of barbecue place. I believe it's counter service. Obviously most things won't be opened at this time in the morning, like restaurants. Actually I think the shops don't open at 10 o'clock. Okay. Whenever we look at the menu. Find a Starbucks, I have to go on coffee. So here's a polite pig menu. Um, sandwiches, sandwiches smoker, so a typical barbecue place. Um, cocktails, apple cider whiskey sour, sounds nice. Draft beer. Yeah, we've got a kids menu as well, smoked pot sliders. Nine dollars for a lot of kids meal. Salads, thirteen dollars. Sandwiches are thirteen, fourteen dollars. Smoker. Who do you have? Look at that. Baby back ribs with a light rub, Layla sweet barbecue sauce. The most expensive things. 
Richard Port. Richard Port. Richard Port. Alright. Okay. That, that's not bad, that's for two people. Uh, this is a fight. Oh, not bad. Red velvet cake. And that's the sides. Quite fancy the, the beans. I had beans last night and um, and chilies. They were absolutely uh, excellent. Black beans, lovely. I know I probably said that last night, but the value we got in there last night was it was really good because we normally just eat from the straight menu and we probably saved ourselves about 20 odd dollars last night. So I don't know what time this opens at, I don't know if it tells you on that, what time it opens at. It's open today. No, I don't think it is. I don't see, I'm kind of figuring everything's about 10 o'clock. And that's the up upgraded World of Disney store. Our little shop I used to, when, whenever we laddie Aaron was, was really young. We laddie's not we laddie anymore. Used to love getting into the Harley Davidson shop and sitting in the bikes. You can't really see through there, I'm not gonna go in. But he used to, used to love it. Yeah, I can see everything's just beginning to open now, so it's just a couple of minutes for, a couple of minutes from 10 o'clock, so I think that's just the doors opening most things. I do remember that, you? As Jackie said, that's a poutine. Kind of hut, hut you would call it, wouldn't it? But you know, like, I've got a Canadian friend and you know, it's, it's chips and gravy and cheese, you know what I mean? It's more. I think it's another than that, is it? I've never had it. So the classic uh, Latin fried yucca, what is this? This yucca, that flat. The Latin one, fried yucca, black beans, mojo pork, queso fresco and lime sour cream. Everything sounds good apart from the yucca, I don't know what that is. And see if I don't know what it is, I'm not eating that. I think the thing you'll find when you come to Disney, obviously with being Disney, I mean alcohol is not a major thing, but the average prices for a beer are, you know, compared to what we are used to in the UK, they're pretty high, so if you look at that, that's great. Labatt, love Labatt, but 875. Mm -hmm. Am I just tight? Am I tight? No. Dodging the camera again. That's the world of Disney store. We'll go in there after. Just go wee walkies now. I'm looking for a Starbucks. Well, we're in the, in the big Disney store. And obviously, we're just coming up to Halloween. Um, so it's really a big thing in America. And we've got loads of merchandise out for it. So, we're going to have a sort of look at some of Mickey top now. Don't know how much that is. You get tags on it. There we go. Sorry about the camera there. Try to find the price. Fifty dollars. Fifty dollars. Hats. Thirty-five dollars. Thirty-five dollars for a hat. And of course the magic bands. Magic bands. Sorry, headbands. Yes. A lot of mini witch type thing. And Jackie likes the the Mexican themed Day of the Dead. Here's Jackie's going to model for us. It's quite cool. They're all the same price. 
What the headband is in place? I think it's a spirit jersey, is it? It is. It's a Halloween spirit jersey. I think they're usually $60. How much is that, Jackie? No price? Well, you get it for nothing now. Huh? If there's no price on it, you get it for nothing. I think they're 60 odd dollars, to be honest with you. I think the spirit jerseys are 60. My favourite thing about Disney is the Haunted Mansion. Jackie knows that. Then there's uh, a pile of Haunted Mansion stuff here. These are Haunted Mansion headbands. How much is that? Um, 35. 35. I think all the t-shirts are about the same. But I'm asking you the price and there it is there. 35. I think they're all the same. The headbands are $28 and the t-shirts are 35. Now, if I could get away with it, I would have that bag, but I don't think I'll get away with it. So they're $80 for that bag. There's another Haunted Mansion T. It's a nice one. Look at that bag. A foolish mortal snap. Oh, that's excellent. Look at this, this is the wee car you go on when you're in the, on the ride. And you see the wee ghosts appearing. That's superb. I think that might be coming home in here. Some more, what was it, kiddies tees. Some Christmas ornaments. And um, haunted mansion ears. Light up. The light up ears, yeah. I mean, obviously it's been during the day, you won't hear it. There might be a lot, oh that pin's in it, you need to pull that pin out. Don't do it. I think they're like, I saw them peppered this, I was going to say they light up as well, but they don't. Haunted Mansion mugs, much of they. Mm -hmm. You get it for nothing now. Haunted, man Haunted Mansion hoodie, and then out of all the years I've seen, I think these ones are the best. I like these ones. I don't like it all. I mean, and a Haunted Mansion spirit jersey. I don't think they're going to work. That'll be. Some no, other side like. like the other. 65. 65. The ghost House. That's actually one of the nicest ones I've seen. Still think it's quite a. Uh, they are quite expensive, but I suppose if you're only going to ever buy one, aren't you? Haunted Mansion glasses, fedora hats, I don't know. I think they're the best deals. Mm -hmm. I like the ones. I was offering to buy Jackie one, but she's not having it. Now, if anybody in the UK remembers a programme back in the 70s, there's a programme called Russell Gummage. I think that's him there. <laughs> well, that's a haunted mansion ghost, but he looks like Russell Gummage. Minnie's bow tier extreme. That's an extreme bow. That's a big bow. <laughs> a big bow. So this, I think we're in a kind of ear section. So there's loads of them. These ones here, I believe, that, what was it, what did they call these ones again? Rose Gold. Um, they were popular last year, I believe. Um, uh, so it's a big, massive section of ears. All different kinds. There's the donut ears. Uh, the kind of lollipop things. Ears. That's, is that up? Is that up ears? Yeah, I don't know what that is there. Can't even see it. Slinky it's dog. Slinky. They're excellent. And again, these are all $28. 28 dollars $28. Aye, they're all uh -huh. $28. So every pair is the same price. Yep. No matter what design. I like the up ones. Yeah. Just a kind of work, isn't it? 
And in this earth, that's just some more of those gold ones. But over in this wall here, there's hundreds, you name it. I think some of them are the Halloween ones. Um, the rainbow ears. And that's your traditional Mickey and Minnie ears. Well, these, these ones are Minnie's, aren't they? That's the extreme ones. Again, this is all the Halloween ones, the Haunted Mansion, which I think is the best one. Jackie likes the Day of the Dead. Pretty cool. And then we've got some hats over here. That's the old Mickey Mouse Club caps. It's the Day of the Dead. It's my birthday. It's cool. Got some of these rainbow ones in here as well. Pretty cool. And I think that's a bride and groom set. Hats are different prices. Hats different prices. So these are ones obviously you can get that are uh, personalised. If you want your ears personalised. Spider-Man, that's a Marvel thing, you know. Stitch, cars. Magic bands. You've never had a magic band, have you? I got an email for Disney today saying that your magic band are ready to be picked up. So, I did a, a surprise Jackie. She didn't even went about this until we arrived. That um, I booked, we're going to Mickey's Not So Scary. And I booked a, I booked a, a night in a Disney hotel. And as, as part of that, even that one night stay, you get the magic bands. So she'll get her first magic band. Disney socks. <laughs> socks. Eleven dollars for a pair of socks. I think when you go to the Disney hotels, I think they just give you the basic, you know, they just give you a, a single colour thing. And normally, if it's because it's so there's male and female, you probably get a pink one, I'll get a blue one. Sorry. Not necessary. I'm saying, I'm talking again in Glaswegian. I'm saying a pink one and a blue one. So for any of our American friends, that's a pink one. And a blue one. I, think I probably get the point. probably my English friends are well struggle with that one. I think they'll get the point. And there's some hats over here. I've just found some incredible stuff. I mean, look at this. I mean, if you see if you were a wee girl, that, how good would that be? Somebody buying you that as a gift. Amazing. And there's the railway the station at this, uh, Disney World. Superb, and then you've got the monorail. monorail. Oh, and that's the, the train that takes you around Disney on Disney Railroad. Superb. And that's a conductor's outfit, looks me an engineer type thing. Type the, I keep saying type thing. Thing. I think it's a thing. <laughs> a wee Disney bus. And look, they've even got the, the shuttle that takes you for the car park. A, again, if many years ago, monorail, many years ago, a test track, many years ago when we used to come here with Aaron, many was a his way, that was all. Just anything to do with cars, he loved. I actually wouldn't mind that myself. Jackie's found a cool bag. That is actually cool, isn't it? How much is that? That's actually alright. Isn't it? It's in the kids section now, so typically just t-shirts and soft toys. These things here, we uh, when Aaron was born, we bought him a set of the Disney store, didn't we? 
and so rotten. Still smell like bacon powder. Mm. <laughs> Alright, there's some more here. You get, obviously you'll get different versions of that, it's a Little Mermaid version, but the one we got was the classic Disney characters, just with every Disney character. Baby Disney. baby Disney, so all the characters were babies, that's right. I'm sure there's collectors collect these things and I wonder if theirs is worth anything. Oh, pretty wee thing. Who needs a cow when you have a bowl? Aye, he's no good. So that stitch up there spitting in people, look. Oh, oh, that's disgusting, spitting people. So this, this is a new section I believe, a newer section where they have food trucks. But what I'm going to do is, Ghirardelli, do you still get, uh, do you still get a free chocolate when you go in? We'll find out. I'm going to turn you off for now. So the answer to that is yes, we still got a free bit of chocolate. It was excellent. The caramel one I got, what did you get? Get a delis. We're going to go back and buy some stuff in there, but just the way to carry it about this. So I'd recommend getting in there. This is my all time favourite place to eat in Disney. Do you want to get Christmas shop first or you want to get something to eat? Uh, Christmas shop, oh well. No. No, no just go. <laughs> I'll wait. See, that's Jackie. Keep me away for the Earl of Sandwich. This is our thing, the Earl of Sandwich. Um, Jackie's just going to go and order for us, but just the way you do it, you just come in, stand in line, the boards are up there. I'll get a bottle up and we'll go away and we'll have different sandwiches, order it, pay for it and then walk down the line and collect it. So I mean, I think you get a tag, things for your sandwich ready, I can't remember. I'll go up and show you that after I've had my sandwich. So, there's my other sandwich coming. Union Jack bag. And it's on a Union Jack. That's been that bag. It's a magic bag. And so the sandwich is uh, wrapped up. I've got a hot sandwich. You got a hot sandwich? Yeah. Jack, what did you get? Chicken, forty uh, chicken, the avocado. Miss Vicky's sea salt chip crisps. Oh no, yeah. Last thing, food mm. crisps, $22. $22, that's alright. So that's my sandwich. That's a tuna melt. It's been coming here for 20 years and it's the only thing I ever get. I'm just going to devour this now. Here's a look at the menu. Um, just like we've got sandwiches and wraps, buffalo chicken. You see, that's what I got. I got the tuna melt. And that's what Jackie got. She bought the avocado. avocado. So these are just all sandwiches. And they're all hot hot, hot sandwiches. And yeah, you can get wraps as well. Definitely wraps. And it's something new that they didn't do. I don't think they did what I could remember them doing last year was uh, kids. They've always done salads, but I'm now actually chicken salad. I don't remember them doing that. And I also don't remember them doing cheese. Remember that? Some soups. Got a wee 
cat's name here. Get a, a gift on a bus. Because this is on the dining plan. So if you're saying it doesn't need to be on the dining plan, basically what we've had is a meal we could get as part of the dining plan. Again, one of the best places to eat in Disney. Seem to stay up for too long. Is it? Five minutes or something. Not in the doorway 